Hello, Year Four. Welcome to your Maths Flip classroom this week. Uh, now, this week, this week, uh, normally I give you arithmetic questions, uh, but for for this flip classroom, I'm going to show you how to get onto your time timetable rock stars, uh, because it's very important that you log on and you start practicing your times tables, uh, because we are thinking about uh, well. You know, it's important that you know that you have your times tables all secure before you go into year five. So uh, and you've got access to times table rock stars at home. You should be accessing this every single day uh, to practice your times tables. Uh, from next week, I will be doing arithmetic questions as well, but they're going to be all uh, to do with multiplication um, and maybe division facts as well. So for this week, it's all about you getting on to timetable rock stars, and I'm going to you're going to you you're going to see in this video how to get on there. So when I share my screen with you, okay, in Google, I've gone into timetable rock stars. I've gone on to my um, onto my account, and I get a page that looks like this. Okay, and uh, what you're going to do. Uh, you should have some times tables to practice that have been given to you already. But what I would like you to do is to use the sound check. So you're gonna click on the sound check one, okay? And you can, uh, when you click on it, you can see how often you played it. I haven't played it for a while, five months ago. Uh, hopefully you guys have been on it a lot longer, uh, quicker than that. Anyway, you click onto it and you click onto play. Okay, and then it gives you five, four, three, two, one. It will then give you questions to answer and you only get six seconds to answer those questions now you can use the mouse to type in the the answers uh, or i believe you can use the keypad uh, the numbers on there as well and then press the enter button to answer your questions and the idea is is that you're going to try to answer your questions as quickly and accurately as you can if you get one wrong don't worry the whole idea of this is to it's just to get you up to speed with your times table. So three times nine is 27. And then I type 27 in. Uh, five times eight is 40. It's probably quicker to use the, the, the numbers on the keyboard. Um, you can practice using a mouse, put, using the numbers here. Um, so one, three, two, it does take a little bit longer as you can see to use a mouse. Um, <clears throat> so you can just see that it's a bit, a bit harder, but you can see it's testing me on all of my times table, ranging from 12 times table all the way through to your one times table. Uh, and you just can't answer the questions as quickly and accurately as you can. So I'm going to just do a few more of these uh, until I get to the end. Uh, Nine times three is 27. We've already had that one. So they will, you know, it's not that they give you a question, you don't get it again. And they're not necessarily easier or harder at the beginning or end. Uh, they're just randomized, okay? That means you can get any type of question uh, relating to your times tables. <clears throat> so I've got five more questions to go, uh, and then I'll be done. 11 times tables is probably the easiest. Look, I've had, oh no, that's not correct. <laughs> yeah, if you do make a mistake, you can press delete, or you can press the backspace uh, space button on the keyboard uh, to delete. Uh, before you press enter. Okay, then once I've done the test, it will uh, take me to my results page and it can tell, it tells me here all my questions and my answers. It says I've got 25 correct, okay? Uh, and that's it. And what I would like you to do is to make sure you don't just do it once, but do it a couple of times every day just to get you really up to speed. And then you'll see in that list that it gives you, you'll see which timetables you're not too confident with. So then you know which ones you need to start practicing at home as well. All right. So uh, good luck with that. And um, yeah, next week your arithmetic will be back to normal, but it will be times tables only. Um, okay then guys, see you, um, see you in the next video. Bye.